Hi students, in today's video I am going to discuss about nomenclature part 4. Part 1 organic chemistry, 11th organic chemistry introduction part I have completed and part 2 and nomenclature I have started. What are the terminology, what are the important points we are using in the nomenclature one by one I am going to discuss. If you have command in all these videos, it is very easy to understand organic chemistry and GOC you can do number of questions in easy way. Ok students, now let us begin nomenclature rules. First one, rules for naming saturated hydrocarbons. Saturated is nothing but all are single bond. All are single bond. In previous video, part 1, I had given classification. So, in classification saturated, I said alkanes. Alkanes, right? <coughs> Excuse me. Next, select first for saturated hydrocarbons, what is the first rule? Selection of parent chain. Selection of parent chain. Parent chain is nothing but your root word. Root word. Next, first one. Chain must be continuous. It must be continuous. Don't take breaks. Next, it must be longest. You have to select the longest chain. And third rule, it may or may not be straight. It may or may not be straight. Now come back to this example. You can understand more better after seeing the structures. See students. Yes, it may or may not be straight. See, if you go through like this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, you will get 5. But 5, if you go through like this, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 5, 6, you are getting. So, whether you are selecting straight chain or not doesn't matter. You are selecting longest chain or not that is matter. That is important one. So, you can take like a branch type also. Like this also you can take it. But you should be select longest chain when saturated hydrocarbons. Okay. Now, here also. So, if you go like this, 5 only, you will get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is wrong selection. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5, 6. This is the longest chain. Clear my point? Now, next one. Next one. Rule 2. Lowest sum rule. What is that students? Lowest sum rule. That means whatever substituents is there, we have to give least number, lowest sum rule. See, I am taking first longest chain. First rule always we have to take it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. If I go like the 6, if I go like the 6, if I go like the 6, no problem. That's why you can take anywhere. Now, afterwards, locants. Locants is nothing but substituents. Whatever, what are the substituents we have now? Here, this is methyl group. This is methyl group, methyl group. See, students, I was not written here entire structure. The carbon like this, nothing but it is CH3 group. Carbon like this means CH2 group. So, uh, already I have discussed primary, secondary, tertiary, quaternary and only skeletons I am explaining to save the time students. This is methyl group. This is methyl group. Like this you have to fill it later. Now, locants. What are locants here substituent? This is methyl group and this is methyl group. This is also methyl group. So, write down numbers where second carbon having methyl group 2 plus and 5 plus 5. Right? 2 plus 5 plus 5. So, what is the number you are getting here? Yes. 12. If you take numbering this side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Here, 2 plus 2 plus 5. 2 times repeated, no? That's why 2 plus 2 plus 5. So, 4 plus 5, 9. So, which is the least number? Right to left. Right to left, <clears throat> right to left, we are getting the least number. That is the best selection. Did you understand my point? Right to left, this is left to right, this is right to left. Which is the best selection? Right to left is the best selection. This is the rule 2. Now, clear. Now, go to the next point. What is the next point, students, here? If two different substituents... 
if two different substituents are possible at equivalent position same positions i'll show an example you can understand more better then carbon carrying the group first alphabetical number is simplest number see first i am selecting the longest chain first i am selecting the longest chain next what i have to take least number right or not now if i am selecting group like this see <coughs> 1 2 3 4 5 6 correct or not no if i take this is the longest chain first rule completed longest chain if you take like this you will get 1 2 3 4 5 6 you are also getting 6 only no problem 1 2 3 1 2 3 here also same thing same thing no problem now next one here then third position see third position ethyl group is there this is cc is nothing but ethyl group ethyl group next third position ethyl group and fourth position methyl group is there who will come first alphabetical order e will come first for e you have to give least number if you go for like this 1 2 3 4 5 6 here fourth position ethyl group is there that is wrong left to to right is wrong right to left is right correct why what is the reason according to alphabetical order we are like writing locants that is substituents one substituent is ethyl another substituent is methyl for first to letter uh, first to letter substituent you have to give least number you have to give simplest number that is least number then what is the sky name students yes 3 ethyl e will come first 3 ethyl next one next one hmm 4 methyl 4 methyl how many carbons here six carbons six carbons in hexane okay now next one i I'll, i'll give you different different examples students to understand more better first each and every rule i am explaining for that i am taking one one example next one don't leave gap between words this is a <coughs> numbering you can give here longest chain 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 this is the longest chain and substituent only one substituent is there if you take left to right the substituent you are giving the least number this is the best selection left to right is best selection if you take right to left that is wrong 1 2 3 4 5 6 sixth position you are getting the substituent but always we have to give substituent second rule least number that's why 2 methyl heptane there is no gap here don't give gaps continuously you can write that's it next branch consists of sub branches or complex branching now look into this branches branch consists of consist sub branches or complex branching branched chain is right in the brackets we have to write in the brackets okay see i am selecting first longest chain this is the longest chain here fifth position sub branch is there the sub branch again have branches this it has branch this branch again have sub branch now how to write this name students fifth position right fifth position what is that 1 2 3 propyl is there and that to which type of propyl again second position methyl group is there then you can write 2 methyl propyl first you have to write branches sub branches first you have to write branch one branches in that branches first you have to write sub branches sub branches we are writing first and then branch and then long chain and then long chain these three we have to remember this is branch students it has sub branch sub branch which group methyl group 2 methyl and this is 1 2 3 propyl 2 methyl propyl yes how many carbons 10 carbons then we call it as decane right in the previous video i had given root words now clear now go to the next example little more tricky example i have taken if the given molecule have two sub two such complexes see here again you can take the numbering okay 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 
10. See fifth position. We have branch. Uh, again same branch we have. Again it has sub branch. It has sub branch. How to write? So don't write die here. In this cases we are using the word bis. If two times same branch repeated means we are writing bris. Okay. And three means three branches means tris. And four branches means tetra. Like this we are writing. Clear? Now I am writing the name. See fifth one. Fifth one. For five comma five. Why? Because two times it is repeated. No, but above case only one time repeated. Here five times repeated. Five comma five. Have bis two times. No, two times means what we are writing? Bis. Okay. Now open the bracket. So second position. Your one, two, three. Next one, two, three. Your second position methyl group. Your second position methyl group. So then what you will write? Two methyl sub branch completed. Now branch. What is the branch? Propyl. Three carbons propyl. Yes, close the bracket. That's it. Now this is decane. Okay, that's it, students. That's it. Hope everybody understood this point. So after seeing our video, please give likes and comments. So how much you understood? So are you happy or not? Okay, next to I am going to do many videos nomenclature. Many videos, one or two videos, it's not possible to complete it. It's ocean. So, all the examples I am giving, and the better way I am giving, and but definitely it is easy to understand, and you can enjoy the exams also. Now, next one rules for next before going to the rules. Next one, I am giving some compounds here. We can give the numbering and naming. Now, see, first one. CH3, CH2, CH, CH3, CH2, CH2, CH3. Okay, this one I have taken. For this name, we have to write the name. How to write the name, students? First, we have to select the longest chain. 1, 2, 3, 4. If I go like this, 4. He will go like this, 4, 5, 6. Okay, now substituent. After that, we have to check the substituent. This is substituent methyl. If I go like this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. If I go like this third position, which is the best one, students? Left to right is the best one. Left to right is the best one. Clear my point? So that's why what you will write 3 methyl, 3 methyl hexane. That's it. This is the name. Next. Important point. Next one. CH3. CH2. CH3. CH. CH. CH2. CH3. This is the this is next example. Can you write the name students? Can you try? So what is this? How to select longest chain? We have to select. If you select long chain like this 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. But if you select like this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. See, if you select like this longest chain 5, no? which is the best one? Which is the best one? I am using another color to understand more better. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is white color. This is right. Correct. Now, substrain. If you give like this numbering, again one more we have to check it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. If you go like this, this is third position only substrain. If you come like this also third position only substrain. No problem. You can write finally 3 methyl pentane. 3 methyl pentane. Clear? Now, Next one. And note point. What is the note point students? Note. In saturated hydrocarbons, in saturated hydrocarbons, second position, second position, ethyl group never come. Ethyl group never come. So please make a note the students. 
in saturated hydrocarbons. Now whatever I am explaining, saturated is nothing but all single bonds, only here. But if we we'll go to the unsaturated and some other rules, polyfunctional rules, function rules and all, that is different, only here, it is not applicable. Second position in the group, never come. If you take like this, see, 1, 2, 3, 4. So, the second position you are writing it means your answer is wrong. Your answer is wrong. Did you understand my point? If you take yellow color, 1, 2, 3, 4 numbering. Second position, 2 ethyl butane. People will write like this, but that's wrong. Second position, never get ethyl group. Now, third one. They are asking sometimes 2, 4, 6, trimethyl hexane. Sometimes they will give names Sometimes they will give names, they will ask you to write the structure. For that time what you will do? Take root word, this is root word, hex 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Next second position, next fourth position, sixth position. If you will come like this also 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, okay. Anywhere you can write, that is your convenient, left to right, generally our convenient is left to right, if they had given structure, your wish, you can take left to right, right to left, if you take left to right, second position methyl group and this is numbering, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, this is you can take it as 5. Two, four, five. 245 trimethyl hexane. That's it. 245 trimethyl hexane. This is the structure. Clear? Now, next one. Two, three dimethyl. Two, three dimethyl. Five ethyl. Sorry, 5 ethyl will not come. First only 5 ethyl. Five ethyl. Two three dimethyl. Two three dimethyl. No name. No name. Known means how many carbons? 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Fifth position. Fifth position. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Fifth position. Ethyl group. Next. Second position. Second position. What you are writing? Methyl. And third position. Methyl. If you take number in this side, you will get 5 only. If you take numbering like this also, ethyl group 5 only. No problem. Otherwise, we have to give priority for ethyl group least number. Here, no problem. So, 5 ethyl, 2, 3 dimethyl, no name. This is the next one. Now, with this, we have completed saturated hydrocarbons rules and some different structures. Example students. Now, I am writing unsaturated hydrocarbons. unsaturated hydrocarbons unsaturated is nothing but it has yes double bond and triple bond okay double bond what we call it as in triple bond what we call it as I but here some note points and giving if DB and TB triple bond present at terminals at terminal give priority for importance priority means priority for DB example like this both are terminal. Terminal is nothing but end carbon. Terminal is nothing but end carbon. Here end carbon, here end carbon. Double bond, triple bond. We have to give numbering here. 1, 2, 
3, 4, 5. Why don't you do here? This is double bond, triple bond. Both are at terminals. Then we have to give priority for double bond. Then what is this guy name, students? What is this guy name? See. Hept. What is this? Sorry, pent. Pi carbons. Pent. Yes, tell me. Pent. 1 in pent 1 in in double bond in e letter e will come first 1 in next 4 i 4 i this is the name clear now next one rule 2 what is the rule 2 here rule 2 if double bond at middle at middle and triple at terminal at terminal give priority for give priority for what is this triple bond terminal only we have to give priority terminal only we have to give priority Okay, clear my point students. Okay, I am giving one example to understand. CH3, C double bond, C, CH2, this is CH2, C <coughs> triple bond, CH. 1, 2, 3, 4. That's it. This is the structure. Can you write what is the name? Can you write? So here what we have to see, what we have to see, double and triple bond, E nines, E nines, right? Previous video had explained all these points, right? Now here we have to give, we, we have double bond students, we have triple bond, but double bond in between, triple bond terminal. Then we have to give priority for triple bond, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then tell me, hept, hept 5 in, Yes, hept 5 in. Why we are writing in first alphabetical order? While writing alphabetical order, priority for triple bond. 5 in, 1 i. 1 i. That's it. Now, next simple examples I am giving now to try to do. This is one of the frequently asking question. Okay, now one, two, three, four, five, six. Most of the students they were selecting like this, but this is wrong. We have to take including double bond. If saturated hydrocarbons is there, we are selecting only longest chain. But this is unsaturated hydrocarbons, no, we have to give double bond priority. So that's why you have to take numbering like this. You have to include like this. 1, 2, next 3, 4, 5. This is the best one. 1, 2, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is correct. First one is wrong. Did you understand my point? Now, numbering why you have taken this side. If you take numbering here, second position, ethyl group. That's it. Can you write the name students? What is the name here? What is the name here? 2 ethyl yes pent pent 1 e pent 1 e that's it. Now next example. Your selection. What is the longest chain here? Your selection. Parent chain is. This is parent chain. While selecting parent chain in unsaturated hydrocarbons, you have to select including double bond, triple bonds. It's not matter to select longest chain. Clear? That's it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's it. Now, if, if you will take with this side also, third position only, no problem. 3 propyl, yes. 3 propyl, 1, 4, 1, 4, 1, 4, pentadiene. Penta, 
dihene. Clear? Two times in. That's why penta dihene. Clear, students? With this saturated hydrocarbons, unsaturated hydrocarbons, rules and examples, it's completed. So, start working questions in your related books. Students, comment and like, subscribe, share our channel, students. Thank you. Thanks for watching.